What's up, guys? Good morning, and thank you so much for taking time out of your day to be here with me. Welcome back to another video. For today, we do have a surprise for you. We have an upgrade going on in the interior on the E90 M3. But before we go any further, I wanted to make sure that you turn on the post notifications. Make sure that you follow your boy. And if you want, you can also follow me on Instagram, alpha underscore M3. Once again, that's alpha underscore M3. And without no further ado, let's jump into it. If you're one of the day ones here on this channel, you can remember that I said for the M3, there's a lot of little things that needed to be upgraded. Well, today, here's one of those things that needed to be upgraded. After months of searching, I finally found something that I think is going to tie in with the interior of the E90 really well. And I'm really excited. So I wanted to give a quick shout out to FCP Euro. That's where I found this piece. Um, from what I saw on the website, it looks amazing. And I'm super excited to see what it looks like here. Oh, <laughs> what do you think, guys? Leave a comment down below and tell me what you think of this shift knob. Wow, I'm not going to lie, guys. I am super impressed with the quality of this shift knob. It's actually kind of late right now, and I wasn't going to do it tonight, but let's head out to put this on. So, as you can see, guys... This is the reason for the new shift knob. This shift knob is, how can we put it, uh, seen its better days. <laughs> it's pretty faded and um, I don't know, for an M3, I'm, I'm pretty meticulous and I just feel like it's time to put this out to pasture. For those that have never seen or have never replaced the shift knob, but potentially might do so, as you can see, I'm just kind of gently prying around the edges and at once you have the entire boot up then you just really need to yank hard on the shift knob once you have the old shift knob removed you'll be able to see that there's like a little groove in the middle for the new shift knob all you got to do is align it up with that and push down super hard and here we are guys so i apologize for the lighting it's pretty late and i have to go to work in the morning so you have to forgive me for that as well i'm pretty beat so here's what the shift knob looks like in better lighting. Also, too, here's a comparison and contrast for the old shift knob and this new sexy shift knob. Not going to lie, guys, I'm digging it. And that's going to do it for today, guys. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Please turn on your post notifications, hit the like button, subscribe button, and I'm going to catch you in the next one. I'm out.